Welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to create our first software application. And software makes it so easy to do. And it's free. You can use a free account. So sign up to software. And then once you do, you'll see your dashboard right here. Now my dashboard has a little bit more filled in because I have a lot of applications. But up at the top, you'll see all of our templates. We have over 100 templates that you can choose from to jumpstart your build. All different categories. And the templates even come with the database already built out and with all the data in there. And for first time builders that aren't doing this course, because I'm going to show you everything you need to know, I recommend starting with the templates because it includes a already built application and the database that is already structured with the database there. And it's a really good learning tool for you to figure out how the database works with software and so much more. But we're not going to do that because we're going to do this together. And then we also have a generate with AI option. Software makes it really easy to build an app, whether it's a client portal, an internal tool, directory, membership platform with AI. All you need to do is enter this prompt, give us some details, some colors, what you're looking to build, and software will do its best to build that app for you. And then from there, you can fully customize it and continue to make it your own. However, what we're going to do today is we're going to start from scratch because I'm here with you and I'm going to show you what you need to do every step of the way to build this beautiful client portal of ours. And when you're starting with Scratch, there are two ways to do it. You can either pick data from any of these data sources, right? And so if you already have data filled in, uh, maybe from Superbase or maybe from HubSpot, you already have all this data. Well, here's a chance to connect that data to software and software will automatically use that data to build an application for you, which then you can use as a starting point to further customize. In our case, though, we actually don't want software to build the app for us because we're going to build it ourselves. So we're going to go through and connect our database the old fashioned way, which is connecting the database. And then we're going to pull in the database that we want to build. And in this case, I have an empty Airtable base that I have yet to do anything to because we're going to do it together. And I'm connecting software to this Airtable database. So there it is. It's asking me if I want to bring in any of the tables. I'll select this and then I'll continue and proceed with creating my first application in software. So it's generating our app and it has built the app for us in record time. Give yourself a pat on the back because you have just created your first software application. We have a great foundation and we're ready to start building. So I'll see you in the next lesson.